Good morning, this is the National Weather Service in Jackson, Mississippi, here with the weather briefing for the week of June 20th, 2023. So the main focuses this week will be severe storms possible today across southern areas along a stalled boundary and heavy rain could cause flash flooding in this area. Many river rivers are currently in flood and drier conditions this week should keep rivers from accessing minor flood stage. So here's a look at the severe storms possible. We have a slight risk across the far southwest and a marginal risk a little further north. Um, the main threats with these are going to be damaging wind gusts up to 60 miles an hour and hail up to golf ball size and in the marginal risk um, hail should be up to quarter size and the timing for this should be mo mainly this afternoon along with that severe threat we do have a risk for flash flooding today um, locally heavy rainfall and localized flash flooding are possible especially in urban and low-lying areas. Here's a look at a surface analysis for today. You can see that stalled boundary across the south, the southern part of our area there, and that's going to be the main focus for storms moving along that. And here's a look at the rivers. As I mentioned earlier, there are a lot of rivers in flood right now, especially the Upper Pearl and more recently, as of yesterday, the Pascagoula has had more stages in flood. So, um, minor flooding is currently expected, um, but given the drier conditions later this week, it should not worsen the conditions. And Here's a look at that seven day precipitation, as I mentioned before. Drier conditions this week with only about a half inch of rain at most, especially across the east and um, the southern parts of our area. And here's a look at the weekly forecast. We are in the summer, so daily storms are possible with the heat and humidity um, slightly Lower temperatures are expected this week, but we should see that increase by the weekend into the mid-90s. And of course, you may have heard Tropical Storm Brett has formed in the Atlantic. This is not um, expected to for, uh, impact our area anytime soon, but we are currently monitoring this over the next seven days. And that concludes our briefing. If you have any questions, feel free to reach us at the number on your screen or via social media.